Yo, what is going on everybody? I am your host Slackers Gaming, bringing you another Super Smash Brothers video. Okay, well I'm realizing, okay, so today is Sunday, technically very early Monday morning. So Sunday I had just nothing going on. I, I literally had like an off day. Nothing was going on. I literally just got to sit back, relax, and just come up with a bunch of videos. I've been, I've probably made about four, f no, one, two, four. I made six, this will be my sixth video today that I made. I'm very happy. I'm I'm so stoked about this. I'm just, I'm having so much fun. And then I got to make one more after this. So it was really cool. I just had so much time to sit down and just make videos. Anyway, let's get to the topic at hand. So this video is about leaks or leaked images. And um, so recently it came out and I made a video about this the other day where G this Gino picture was confirmed fake Sadly, this was kind of the one that we're, a lot of the community was going off of when it was recently, uh, it kind of came out that somebody at Nintendo or a third party kind of had their feathers ruffled about some image leak. We all thought it was Gino because, you know, spilling the beans about a third party character, that's kind of big news, you know. So with this being deconfirmed, I have seven, I think seven pictures, six, no, seven. I have seven images that I think have to be the leading candidates for that, well, potentially real, real fake leak. What? Does that make sense? Anyway, let's just jump into it. Here comes the first one. And here's the first one that I don't see too many people talking about. Nowhere have I seen this debunked. So, and keep this in mind for any of these future pictures. If you have actual proof of somebody somewhere deconfirming any of these pictures, Please let me know because I have I've looked at all these pictures and the the ones that I've gathered here are the most credible not credible but most likely in my opinion that could be fake. Now going back to that ruffled feathers quote, Chocobo from Final Fantasy. First of all, we got the uh, Chocobo um, the, uh, the 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 me outfit. Maybe that's leading to something. I don't know. I mean, think about Chocobo as a, like, perfect just WTF character, right? Third party, iconic, people know what it is. That would be, it would be such an interesting character, honestly. Um, I've seen this, again, I don't know if this has actually been debunked just from the sources that I've been looking at, from the, um, just all over the internet where I've been looking. Nowhere has this actually legit been, oh, creator came out and said this is fake. So, Chocobo, maybe. I don't know. Moving on to the next one, number two. Uh, okay, so here's the Black Shadow picture that uh, kind of came out like a month or so ago. It's kind of creepy because, let's zoom in, here's his, uh, here's his mouth. He's got that sharp teeth and he's got the weird smile. And everyone's like, could this possibly be real? You know, it, you know, it doesn't, Nintendo could just be, you know, upset themselves that an image leak came out. Maybe it's Black Shadow. But one thing people do point out about this is that... Uh, this can't be real because it's not in the correct order. You know, Black Shadow is not after Ridley. Well, hold on. Here's a good point. When you unlock characters, that is an option for how you rearrange the character selection screen by the order the characters get unlocked. So it is possible if Black Shadow's in the game, it is possible that you could unlock Ridley and then Black Shadow. And so they, that's why they would be next to each other. Somebody said this is a demo version i don't know if that's true was mewtwo in the demo i don't think he was i could be wrong i don't think mewtwo is in the demo was he maybe i'm not quite sure but uh that it's just kind of a point you know for this you know being real you can unlock characters and then rearrange them on the character selection screen in unlocking order i think you can do it by series or just by how they've appeared in the uh, Smash games, you know, numbered 1 through 70 whatever characters, however many we end up getting. But that's the Black Shadow one. It looks weird. It's a cool render, at least. You know, it looks different. Um, it definitely has people talking. Is it real or not? Let me get, uh, let me know what you guys think. And if you just say fake, I mean, that, that doesn't help me. Do, you, do anybody actually have proof of these being fake? So, uh, moving on to number 3. Here's one that's maybe a bit iffy. There was that thing, um, I guess, leak about what two months ago i want to say about black knight the background of one of the fire emblem stages where it wasn't 
actually Black Knight sitting on the throne in the background. It was a red knight, or he had like a red cape or red armor or something on. So it kind of led people to start thinking, would Black Knight be an echo fighter of Ike? Makes perfect sense. And plus, it kind of fits with the hero versus villain theme. Uh, Black Knight would be such a cool character. Was pretty highly voted on the character ballot. Uh, so he's got a lot of backers behind him. Uh, it would make sense, but would they give Fire Emblem a new or another character and another Echo Fighter? Because we already have Krom. Are we going to get another one in Black Knight? I think it's possible. It is possible, but I mean, only time will tell really if any of these are actually real. So personally, I would love this uh, to be real. Black Knight would be such a cool character. Of course, like I said, he'd just be an Echo Fighter of Ike. That's a, what a lot of people would think. I just think you'd bring, you know, such a cool feel and presence to the game. I, you know, be really cool in my opinion. So yeah, that's what number three or something. Moving on to the next one. I know it's a character banner art, but uh, and these like are never real. But look, I mean, this one's pretty good. Uh, and again, if any of these are fake and you guys can like tell me legit it's fake, give me like a source of you know proof that this is fake. Please let me know, because like I said, I've looked at these and nowhere could I determine that these are actually fake. Nobody's come out and said these are fake. So, character artwork, Rayman above King K. Rule fits in with the art style. I like it. it it's probably one of the top two artworks uh, or banner artwork styles that I've seen for characters. This one is convincing to me. Again, nobody has come, out, come forward and said this is fake or that they've done it themselves. At least not that I know of, so it's very possible. I kind of, I would kind of like this. Rayman was always kind of figured to be that third party from Ubisoft. Ubisoft does not have a rep in Smash Bros. as a playable character. Rayman is pretty much like the leading candidate for that. Maybe Rabbids, but I see them more as an assist trophy if they did get in. But this one looks pretty good. It's it's viable, you know, it's believable. So I got that for you. Um, What do we got next? Next, hello? Oh, there we go. <laughs> All right, now, help me out. Is this Arle, Arl from the Puyo Puyo series? I don't know. Somebody's telling, people are telling me this is Arl, but Arl, Arl, Arle, I don't know how to, I'm just going to say Arl. It's probably wrong. But uh, it looks, it looks like her. And if this, if it is indeed a third party that's got their feathers ruffled, you know, about a character being revealed, potentially third party, Sega, Sega owns Puyo Puyo, right? I think so. I mean, I guess this it fits. So this is quite a decent possibility, I would say. Um, she, yeah, Puyo Puyo. I don't really know anything about her, honestly. I think she's pretty popular in Japan. It's probably the only thing I know about her. So, I mean, popular in Japan, you got a good chance to be in Smash Bros. Uh, you know, history. history's told us about that. So, uh, yeah. Um, I... I don't know anything about her, so I can't really give too much of an opinion. So, uh, moving on to, I think, the second to last one. And this one, I could not find, like, an actual kind of render for this shadow. It doesn't look, um, it doesn't look like a reused asset. It could be. It could be, but I couldn't find anything on that. Uh, shadow, I mean, of course, shadow's not up here because shadow would be next to Sonic, presumably some form of echo fighter, maybe semi echo. It's, you know, qu very quite possible. That's why, you know, like I just said, you're not going to see him on the character selection, character selection screen. Easy to say, say that 10 times fast, go. Uh, and, uh, so I don't know. This one is believable. I think it could work again. I don't know. It's, it's, it's believable. So it's on the list. And the very last image I have is probably the best one that I, this has the most proof going for it that I could find. You're probably going to agree with me once you see it. And it's not a character per se, because it doesn't have to be a character image that people were all up in arms about, you know, like, oh, what's going on? It could be a stage. That is right. Tilt it. I'm joking. This is completely, I'm joking. This is. I wanted to have a little laugh here at the end, but Tilted Towers as a stage. <sighs> what? <laughs> this one's for the memes. I get it, but I just wanted to end you with a little bit of a joke. But, yeah, that's what I kind of got. These are, I know it says seven in the title, in the thumbnail, or something like that, but six actually legit pictures and a meme. 
Tilted Towers. But yeah, that's what I got for this one. Um, Let me know what you guys think. Do you have any proof of any of the actual, the first six photos I showed? Not the Geno, but uh, the first actual, I think, leaked pictures, you could say. Do you have any proof that it is fake? Please let me know down in the comments. If you have a link to anything, please please share. Um, otherwise, what do you guys think? Could these, what, do you believe them? Could they pass as being, uh, could they pass as being believable? Could they be real? Who knows? I think it's possible. Um, a lot of them are pretty decent. So, uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think down in the comments. That is pretty much going to wrap up this one. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Uh, again, just, uh, seven pictures or seven of the best, uh, image leak pictures that, uh, I guess are the front runners that we're going on right now. So anyway, that is going to be it for this one. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully we we'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out, everybody.